Hello. Hello, welcome back to a new class. How have you been? How was your day? Okay. Okay, welcome back to all of you. Good evening. Can you hear me very well? Yes, teacher. Okay, it's a pleasure to see you again. I'm here, teacher. We are ready to start. Good evening, teacher. Good evening. Welcome back. Thank you, teacher. Okay. How was your day? Very well. Okay, very nice. Everything, everything good. Okay, okay, excellent. What about you, Reynaldo Castro? How was your day? Uh, fine, the teacher. Okay, I like that. What about you, Karina? What can you tell me about your job on this day? Was tired, teacher. Was tired? Yes. Really hard? 
Yes. Okay. What about you, Christina? I am tired, teacher. Tired, okay. It's a lot of traffic. A lot of traffic. Yes. Okay. It is called, we call it in English, a traffic jam. Have you seen the word? Yes. Traffic jam. Traffic jam. Yep. Okay. Mm, what about you, Julia? How was your day? Mm, very fine. Thank you. Okay. Raquel, Judith, what can you tell me about your day? Fine, teacher. Very okay. good. Okay, excellent. What about you, Maria Idalia? Ah. Uh, well, there were a lot of work to do. Okay, okay. Thank you. <laughs> what about, let me see, somebody else, Karina, Marlene? Ah, Karina is there, okay. Marlene, Marlene. Hello, good evening. Oh. Okay, remember that uh, today we are going to start making a review about the previous topic. The last activity that we you were trying to solve. I hope that you got enough time in order to do it and we are going to do it at the beginning of this class. You got what I said or not? ¿Se comprendió lo que dije o no? Yeah, teacher. Oh. Oh. Ok. Vamos a iniciar haciendo un review, un repaso de la última actividad que hicimos el día de ayer. Quienes no lo hicieron, pues lo vamos a hacer al inicio. And that way we are going to uh, remember what we studied yesterday. Okay. Well, first of all, I'm going to check up the, the attendance. Vamos a ver la asistencia porque ya pasaron ocho minutos. Ana del Carmen. Ana. No aquí. Ok, Ángel Narciso. Present, teacher. Excellent. Eh, Cristina. Cristina. Present, teacher. Ah, ok. Giovanni. Maya, Person Manuel. Present. Welcome. Jose Miguel. Juan Carlos Palacios. Present. Welcome. Karina Noemi. Present. Welcome. Linda Ivet. Not here. Maria Idalia. Here I am, teacher. Okay, thank you. Maria Julia. Present, teacher. Thank you. Marlene Nicole. Present. Okay, Marvin Omar. 
Nancy Ivette. Nancy Ivette. Norma Carolina. Norma Carolina. Rafael Ernesto. Present teacher. Raquel Judith. Present teacher. Welcome, welcome. Reinaldo Castro. Present, present teacher. Okay. Suleima. Suleima. Nahir. Xiomara El Carmen. Nahir. Ana Cristina Chavarría Flores. Okay, let me count it first. I got 12, I got 12. Somebody's missing, somebody's missing. Ah, Jose Miguel is here. Present teacher. Okay, okay, okay. Let me see. Let me see. Jose Miguel, I got I got you here. Okay. Okay, as I told you before, we are going to start talking about the, the previous topic that we talked yesterday. Okay, who wants to remember the topic that we studied yesterday? Only one, please, only one. Who wants to tell me? We are studying. We study about the imperatives. Ah, okay. Imperative. Okay, excellent. Okay, do you remember that uh, at the end of the class you were working in a conversation using imperative? Yes. Yes, teacher. Okay, I need that you perform the conversation. I don't know if you are ready. I don't remember uh, who was my partner. Really? <laughs> yes. <laughs> I don't think so. That's true. Okay, try to remember, please. Try to remember. Okay, somebody else want to say something about it? Okay, si no se recuerdan con quién trabajaron el día de ayer. Okay, I'm going to assign you a partner. Me tocará entonces asignarles una pareja con quien lo vamos a hacer. What about you, Juan Carlos? Do you remember the name of the person that worked with you yesterday? 
Con Nancy Beth. Ah, is there Nancy? Where is it? Yeah. Not here. It's not here, okay. Uh -huh. Uh, eh, pero sí hicimos un proceso. Okay, okay, okay. What about you, Rafael Ernesto? Do you remember the name of the person? Me teacher. Okay, Julia. Oh, um, Marlene. Is Marlene here? Yeah. Ah, okay, he's there. Okay, go ahead, please. Okay. Uh, hello, Miss Rivera. Today is your first day at the plant. My name is Miss Gomez, and I'm going to explain what you must to do in the production line. Nice to meet you, Miss Gomez. Where do we start? First, you need how the prepress a prover. Second, print the material. Third, laminate the material. And finally, finally, put the material and fill in a report and weight the material. Okay, thank you. Okay, bye. Okay, thank you. Somebody else, please. Vamos rapidito, rapidito. No sé por qué, pero hoy han entrado menos. I don't know why. Maybe it could be because of the traffic. No. Okay, somebody else, please. I need at least two more couples in order to make the review. Hello, I'm waiting. Ok, entonces vamos a preguntar así democráticamente. And it's going to be uh, alone. You are, you are not going to need the, the help of anybody else. Ok. In a hurry, I need that you tell me two sentences using imperative. Okay, write your hand if you if you have the answer, please. Open the door, please. Open the door, please. Okay. What else? It's missing one. I said two. What else? Come on, I need that you hurry up, hurry up, please. Okay, somebody else, somebody else, please. Clean this car. Clean this car, okay. Sit down, please. Sit down, okay. Turn on your cameras, please. Ah, this es is an imperativa. Excellent. What else? <clears throat> mm -hmm. 
No smoking. Ah. Don't smoke here. Don't smoke. Don't no smoke. Okay, don't smoke. What else? ¿Qué más? ¿Qué más? No parking. Ah, oh, do not park here, okay? Excellent. Okay, can this is sorry, teacher is toys and I'm doing okay. Okay, no problem. <clears throat> I understand that situation, but it's really important that you be connected. Because remember at the end of uh, every section, uh, we got a amount of uh, minutes and that helps you a lot in your assistant. Es muy importante que se conecten siempre porque te van contabilizando los minutos que usted permanece en la plataforma. That is really important, okay? Okay, what else? ¿Qué más? It is something easy. When we talk about imperative, it is like, okay, uh, try to do what I'm going to say. Raise your hands. Veamos a ver si me están entendiendo lo que quiero que hagan. Estoy dando imperative sentences. Raise your hands. Raise your hands. Only one. Only one. Only one. Got. Okay, but in this uh, in this moment, what I want is if I say raise your hand, you are going to do this. Okay. Okay, let me see. Touch your uh, right shoulder. Touch your right shoulder. Let me see. Touch your right shoulder. Only one, only one. Solo uno, dos. El resto no me comprendió la instrucción. Okay, thank you. Thank you. Okay, close your eyes. Open it. Ah, okay. Say hello. Say hello. Say hello. 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 Yeah, hello. In, in a gesture. In a, in a gesture. Hello. Hello. In a gesture. Say hello with your hand. Ah, okay. Julia. Only Julia. And what about the rest? Ah, lo que no acostumbran a decirle hola. Ah, son muy serios, ya lo vi. Really serious. Okay, let us start now talking about the new topic that we need to study today. <clears throat> let me see what we have here. Hold on. Second, please. <clears throat> okay, I got it here. I got it. I got it. Okay, we already talked about this. You already this is the class number four. We already talked about the review of the previous topic. And we are going to start with this conversation. I need that all of you can read it and then we are going to practice. Listen to your teacher with the conversation, then practice with the pattern. Conversation is between Peter and Berta. 
Okay, Berta, do you think uh, that our company should improve the manufacturing process? I believe so. Why do you ask? Because if we do so, we reduce cost. I see. I think that we should do what other companies are doing. And that is getting new equipment. I mean, we should not have the same machines with the same programs. We should be in the 21st century, right? Maybe we should talk about that in the next meeting. Okay. I'm going to read it again. I'm going to read it again and it's going to be in this way. Okay, Berta, do you think that our company should improve the manufacturing process? I believe so. Why do you ask? Because if we do so, we reduce cost. I see. I think that we should do what other companies are doing. And there is getting new equipment. I mean, we should not have the same machine with the same program. We should be in the 21st century, right? Maybe we should talk about that in the next meeting. Okay. Uh, let me see, Harrison. Could, could you read the conversation, please? Okay, teacher. Berta, do you think that our company should employ the manufacturing process? I believe so. What do you ask? Because if we do so, we reduce costs. I see. I think that we should do what other companies are doing. And that is getting new equipment. equipment. I mean, we should not have the same machines with the same programs. We should be in the 21st century. Right. Maybe she'll talk, maybe she'll talk about that the, in the next meeting. Okay, okay. I need that all of you paying a special attention to this word. The letter L doesn't sound. Should, listen, should, should, repeat, should. 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 Okay, should. Should. Okay, okay, okay. Should. Without the letter L, not should, yes, should. Should. Okay. Should. Uh, let me see. I'm going to ask you to read in order. Okay, Julia, could you read it, please? Oh. Yes. Uh, Berta, do you think that our company should provide the manufacturing process? I believe, I believe so. What do you ask? Because if we do so, we reduce cost. I see. I think that we should do what other companies are doing, and that is getting new, getting new equipment. I mean, we should not have the same machines with the same programs. We should be in the 21st century, right? Maybe we should talk about that in the next meeting. Okay, improve, improve, repeat, improve. Improve. Doing. 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 Equipment. 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 Okay, let me see. I got another name here. What about the man who got the Huawei Wi-Fi P? Okay, remember that uh, at the beginning of the class, 
we recommend you to connect with your names. So please, you need to follow these rules. Recuerden que una de las reglas al inicio fue que deben de conectarse con sus nombres y apellidos. And that way it's going to be easy for me to call you by name. Okay. Could you do it, Raquel? You did. Could you read it, please? Okay, teacher. Berta, do you think that our company should improve the manufacturing process? I believe so. Why do you ask? Because if we do, we do so, we reduce cost. I see. I think that we should do one to what other companies are doing, and that is getting new equipment. I mean, we should not have the same machine with the same program. We should be in the 21. Right. Maybe we should talk about that in the next meeting. OK, thank you. What about you, Reynaldo? Could you read it, please? Berta, do you think that our company should improve the manufacturing process? I believe so. Why do you ask? Because if we do so, we reduce costs. I see, I think that we should do what other companies are doing. And that is getting new equipment. Equipment. I mean, we should not have the same machine with the same programs. We should be in the 21st century. Right. Maybe we should talk, talk about that in the next meeting. OK, thank you. We should talk about that in the next meeting. We should talk about that in the next meeting. Okay, Rafael Ernesto, do you want to read it? Okay. Bertha, do you think that our company should improve the manufacturing process? I believe so. Why do you ask? Because if we do so, we reduce costs. I see, I think that we should do what other company are doing. And that it, getting new equipment, I mean, we should not have the same machine with the same programs. We should be in the 21st century. Right, maybe we should talk about that in the next meeting. Okay, thank you. Ana Cristina, do you want to do it? That's our company, Sol Pro, the manufacturer. I believe so. We do you because if we do so, we reduce costs. I see. I think that we should do what other companies are doing, doing, and that is getting equipment. I mean, we should not have the same business. This should be the percent. Why? I be told about that next meeting. Okay, thank you. Remember that the letter L right here, it doesn't sound. 
Talk. To talk. Ok, talk. Xiomara del Carmen. Xiomara del Carmen. Berta, do you think that our company should improve the, ma the manufacturing process? I believe so. I believe so. We do just got us. Cow is we do so. We reduce costs. I see. I think that we shall do what other companies are are doing, and that is getting new equipment. I mean, I mean, we should not have the same machine with the same program. We should be in the 23rd century. Why? Maybe we should think about that in the next meeting. Okay. Meeting. Okay. Meeting. Thank, thank you. I'm going to read it again and later, uh, then you are going to practice with somebody else. Berta, do you think that our company should improve the manufacturing process? I believe so. Why do you ask? Because if we do so, we reduce costs. I see. I think that we should do what other companies are doing. And that is getting new equipment. I mean, we should not have the same machine with the same program. We should be in the 21st century. century. Right. right. Maybe we should talk about that in the next meeting. OK, any question? Before to go to the breakout room, any question? Hello? No, no question. No question. No question. Ah, no. ok. Vamos a hacer entonces algo. Cada quien lo va a hacer solito. Después, cada palabra que no suene eh, tan cerca me la van a repetir 15 veces. Me van a escribir la pronunciación en su cuaderno y you are going to show me. Ok, I got it here, teacher. No, I'm not just kidding. Es una broma, sí. Ok. Let us do it now, please. Let me see how many people do we have. Only yes, 14. Tengo pocos, no sé por qué tengo solo 14 el día de hoy. Me faltan 6. Okay, here we go. Try to practice this conversation, please. Solo tengo una persona que no está conectada con su nombre. Para la próxima vez, tratemos de conectarnos con nuestros nombres. Por favor. Eso nos sirve para identificarlos de una manera más fácil y sencilla. Okay, here we go. Ah, let me see how many minutes are you going to practice? It's going to be three minutes. Okay. Okay. Here we go. Okay, in this moment, uh, all the participants are, are practicing the conversation. Now that you are watching this video, remember that it's really important that you practice speaking. 
I know that all, all, all the skills are really important, but right now uh, we need to communicate in this way. That means that we need to practice a lot. And one way, you know, a better way to do it is just having a, a conversation, practicing the dialogue. Good evening, teacher. Hello, Giovanni. Just a moment. <laughs> I was shaking, I was shaking um, your words. And suddenly I saw that some of you leave the room. I don't know why. Okay. De repente vi que alguno dejó, abandonó la sala y me dejó hablando ahí al compañero o a la compañera. I don't know why. Ok, comencemos entonces con la conversación. Uh, let me see who is going to be the first one. Ok, María, eh, let me see. Ajá. Ok, who wants to... Who wants to be the first? Quien quieres hacerlo primero? Let us do it now, please. Rafael and I, we want to try. Okay, do it now. Excellent. Rafael, you first. Okay. Berta, do you think that our company should improve the manufacturing process? I believe so. Why do you ask? Because if we do some, we will do it cut. I see. I think that we should do what other companies are doing. And that is? Get it new equipment. I mean, we should not have the same machines with the same program. We should be in the 21st century. Right. Maybe we should talk about that in the next meeting. Okay, thank you. Nice. Excellent. Somebody help, please. One, two, Don Narciso. three, four. Don Narciso. Five. Come on, I need the you. Be ready. Okay, Christina. Hello. Hello. Berta, do you think that our company should improve the manufacturing process? I believe so. Why do you ask? Because I will do, do so. We reduce cost. I see. I think that we should do what other companies are doing. And that is? Getting new equi equipment. I mean, we should 
not have the same machine with the same program we should be in the 21th century. Right. Maybe we should, should talk about that in the next meeting. Okay. Okay, Thank okay, you. okay, excellent. Okay, somebody else, please. Person. Okay. No. So, me, Peter, or you, Peter? You, Peter. Okay, let's go. Berta, do you think that our company should improve the manufacturing process? I believe so. Why do you ask? Because if we do so, we reduce cost. I see. I think that we should do what other companies are doing. And that is? Getting new equipment. I mean, we should not have the same machines with the same program. We should be in the 21st century. Right, maybe we, sorry, right. Maybe we shall talk about that in the next meeting. Okay, thank you. Somebody else, please. I'm giving you the chance to practice. So please try to do it. Okay. Do you think that all company should improve the manufacturing process? Reinaldo. It's with me, Juan. <laughs> I believe so. Why do you ask? Because if we do so, we reduce cost. I see. I think that we should do, should do what other companies are doing. And that is? Getting new equipment. I mean, we sure do have the same machines with the same programs. We should be in 20th century. Right. Maybe we should talk about that in the next meeting. OK, OK, thank you. Somebody else, please. Hello, Hello. Yeah. Hello. Yeah. company to improve the manufacturing process. I believe so. Why do you ask? Because if we do so, we reduce cost. I see. I think that we shall do what other companies are doing are doing and that is getting new equipment i mean we should, should not have the same machine with the same program we should be in the 20 21 century. 21st. Can you please? Right. Maybe we should talk about that in the next meeting. Okay, okay, thank you. Somebody else, somebody else, please. Okay, I, I would like to remember you again that if you have uh, your material, your notebook with you, please 
Uh, when you find a word that is difficult for you to pronounce it, just write down uh, the pronunciation as the way that you listen, because in that way you are going to remember. Les recuerdo una vez más, deben de tener, eh, si no tienen impreso su material, en su cuaderno puede escribir la palabra y a la par la pronunciación como usted la comprende. Para que al momento de que vayamos leyendo, vayamos avanzando con mayor facilidad. ¿Ok? Okay, let, let us take a look at the conversation again, because I need that you tell me something about it. Okay. Okay, take a look at the words in bold. And what can you tell me about it? Veamos las palabras que están en negrilla. ¿Y qué me pueden decir de ellas? Hello. Hello. Okay, tell me something about it. What do you think? Why do you think that uh, in the conversation, these words in bold are uh, in a different way from for the rest? Should, tell me. Uh, should is a suggestion. I like that. Is improvisado. Debería improvisar. Mm, ok, ok. ¿Qué más? I think only that. Ok. ¿Somebody else? Debería ser. Should do. Mm -hmm. Should improve. Should do, should be, should talk. Okay, what is the meaning in Spanish? About should be, what is that? Yes. Debería ser. Mm. Okay. Debería estar. Huh? Debería ser is gonna be here, should do. What about should be? We, we deberíamos, should be. Deberíamos, deberíamos estar en el, en el siglo XXI. Ah, in the 21st okay. century, okay. And what about should talk? Should talk. Deberías hablar. Deberíamos hablar sobre mm -hmm. la próxima reunión. Okay, okay, I like that. I like that. <clears throat> Then... If we already know and we already started this, in another word, what can you tell me? When we can use should and why we are going to use should? Tell me, please. Díganme, por favor. Hello. Entremos en contexto. When, when we give a advice. When we want to give advice, okay. What else? ¿Qué más? Okay, let us answer this question first in order to discuss. Okay, we have uh, two questions. Say if the statement below are true or false. How is the manufacturing process in your company? I don't know why this interaction is not the right one because right here we have a, an information question and, and right here it said, Say if the statement below are true or false. Okay, it is right to say, how is the manufacturing process in your company? What do you think about the equipment at your company? Does it need to be 
are great and why? What do you understand about this question? What can you tell me about the first one? Hello? First of all, uh, maybe it is really important to talk about if in your company you have a manufacturing process or not. If you have it, you are going to tell me how is the manufacturing process. It is right, it is excellent, it is good, you need to upgrade some equipment. And the second one, why? Uh, what do you think about the equipment at your company? Does it uh, need to be upgraded? Why? ¿Cómo es el proceso de manufactura en su compañía, si es que la hay? Tell me. Or, or maybe you think that your company uh, should change something. ¿O será que la compañía necesita cambiar algunas cosas, máquinas, procesos? And the second one said, ¿Qué piensas acerca de lo el equipo en su compañía? Ya necesita ser reemplazado y por qué? What can you tell me about that? Hello. Give me an answer. Give me an answer, please. What do you think about the equipment at your company? I'm waiting, I'm waiting, I'm waiting for your answer. Please tell me. Okay, I'm waiting. Uh, teacher. Oh, hello. Podría ser, uh, my company show show expand the facilities to the better service serve customers. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Should expand. Okay, excellent. What else? Okay, let us continue because we don't have enough time to do this. Okay, let us talk about should. I'm going to explain you a little bit about this. Should is a model there. After should you use the base form of the infinitive without the word the word to. And I got an example here. Go instead of we are going to say go instead of to go. A mouse are go and they say to go. Should plus verb uh, is like, um, I'm sorry. Should plus verb, it is the same like say the base form of infinity. For example, you should go now. This is the right way. Do not say you should you should to go now, not in this way. This is the right one. Okay. Take note about that. Take note about that, please. Tomen nota por favor de eso. Okay, should. With model verb, there is only one form 
of fit for every subject prompt. Solo existe una forma para cada pronombre. Por ejemplo, I should, you should, he should, uh, he should, it should, we should, they should. There is never an S at the end of the should. No hay una S al final de should. Puedo usarlo con tercera persona y no va a cambiar. He should study. It's not correct. He should study. It's the right one. After should, we have the big form of the infinitive. It is like bear without two. Like the example that I already explained, you should plus the verb plus the verb form of the infinity. You should go now is correct. You should to go now is not correct. He should wait is the right one. He should wait. Why is not correct here? Tell me. ¿Por qué no es correcta la última? Dígame a alguien, por favor. Because it's without the letter S. Yeah, because this is an auxiliary and, and we can have both inflection on it, okay? Okay, we have an example. Example sentence that we should, I should eat more baseball. Listen, I should eat more baseball. You should take an umbrella. Maybe it's going to rain. He should go to the doctor. If you feel sick, uh, it's better that you, you should go to the doctor. She should apply for the job. It should be fine. We should study more. They should wait until tomorrow. And we have a note here, one other thing. We do not pronounce the L in the word should. Okay, I already explained you this, that you don't have to pronounce, you don't have to say should. Should, not should, it should. Okay, I need some volunteer who wants to read it, uh, this example, please. Can I have one, two or three, please? Volunteers who want to read it? Me, teacher. Okay, Maria, tell me. Um, uh, wait. Should eat more vegetables? You should, oh, I should eat more vegetables. Okay. You should take an umbrella. He should go to the doctor. She should apply for the job. It should be fine. We should study more. They should wait until tomorrow. Excellent. I like that. Okay, thank you. Somebody else, please? Me, teacher. Ok, Giovanni, no sé quién más habló ahí al ah. mismo tiempo. Cuando estoy presentando no puedo okay. ver, eh, solamente tengo que estar ahí un poco listo, solo veo el primer nombre, así es que quien quedó el segundo lo va a hacer luego, rapidito. Ok, go ahead. I should eat more vegetables. You should take an umbrella. She should go to the doctor. She should apply for the job. It should be fine. We should study more. They should wait until tomorrow. Okay, thank you. I'm sorry to stop sharing because I need to check up the assistant. Estábamos ahí como bien concentraditos, ¿no? Cuando de repente sonó la campana de la asistencia. 
Okay, hold on a second, please. Wait, 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 wait. Sign on here. I got it. I got it. Okay, I got your names. Let me call you by name, please. Okay, here we go. Ana del Carmen. Present teacher. Okay, welcome. Uh, Angel. Present teacher. Cristina. Present teacher. Giovanni. Present teacher. Harrison. Present. Uh, Jose Miguel. Present teacher. Okay, welcome. Juan Carlos. Present teacher. Farina. Present. Linda. 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 It's not there. Maria Idalia. I am here, teacher. Maria Julia. Present. Marlene. Present. Marvin is now here. Okay, um, Nancy. Present teacher. Okay, okay. Hey, Norma Carolina. Norma Carolina. No. Rafael Ernesto. I'm here, teacher. Okay, um, Raquel. Present, teacher. Reinaldo. Present, teacher. Suleima. Suleima. Not here. Xiomara. Present, teacher. And Ana Cristina. Ana Cristina Chavarria. Ok, entonces solo nos ha quedado Suleima, eh, Norma y Mark. Let me see, I got another one here. Linda y Beth, Linda y Beth. No está. Ok. Okay, going back again to the topic that we were discussing. Okay, um, one way that we can use uh, should is to give advice, recommendation or a suggestion. This is to say that it is the right thing to do or the correct thing. For example, you should see the new Star Wars movie. It's great. He should go to the dentist if his tooth still hurt. The test is next week. We should study for it now. You should try the new restaurant on Main Street. Okay, somebody wants to read? Who wants to read it? Me, teacher. Okay, Maria. Um, you should see the new Star Wars movie. It's great. 
he should go to the dentist if his tooth is still hard. The test is next week. We should study for it now. You should try the new restaurant on Main Street. Okay, thank you. Excellent. Somebody else, please. Somebody else? Me, teacher. Okay, go ahead. You shall see the new Star Wars movie. It's great. He should go to the dentist if his tooth is still hard. The test is next week. We should study for it now. You should try that new restaurant on Main Street. Okay, you try the new restaurant, Main Street. Okay. Okay, somebody else, please. Me. Okay, Christine. You should see the new Star Wars movie. It's great. They should go to the dentist if he too still hurt. The test in next week, we should study, study for it now. You should try that new restaurant on my street. On Main Street, okay. Okay, thank you. The second one said to express that a situation slightly in the present or in the future. This is type of expectation or prediction. Mary should be at home now, give her a call. But in this case, I am giving you this uh, a kind of sector information because uh, this word we can use in different uh, way. We should have the letter now. I sent it last week. Remember that we are talking about expectation or prediction. Our team should win the game on Saturday because we have been training all month. So it is our expectation or prediction that we will win. It should be sunny tomorrow. This is another way how we can use should. But right now you are uh, paying attention, especially to the function of giving advices, okay? But try to keep in mind. Okay, what about this? Let us do this exercise. This is Mark. He says uh, stomach ache. What is the right answer? Number one, two, or three. What can you tell me about it? And of course, we are going to put out in the gap the word should. He should visit the doctor. He should? Visit the doctor. Visit the doctor, okay. Okay, imagine that uh, he has an stomach okay, and you say he should eat candies today. <laughs> okay, or only just say he, he should take medicine. And, but sometimes with kids, we, it, it is better if we take them to the doctor in order that he or she can see it. Okay, what about this one? This is Maggie, she has a broken leg. What can you suggest? Hello. Hello. This is Maggie. Could you repeat, please, again? This is Maggie. This is Maggie, right? She has a broken leg. What suggestion or advice can you give her? She should rest at home. Ah, she should rest at home. Okay, imagine that somebody says she should play soccer. Or maybe somebody says she should jump in the park. Okay, what about this one? This is, uh, these are Alex and Wanda. It's raining outside today. What can you tell? What can you tell them? Somebody else, please. They should wear a raincoat if they go out. Okay, everyone, they should wear a raincoat if they go out. Okay. 
Imagine that somebody say they should play outside today or they should drink something hot. Mm -hmm. Ah, makes sense too. Okay, this is uh, Serena. She has homework. What can you tell? What can you tell her? Hello? She should uh, hurry up and finish. She should hurry up and finish. Okay, or she should ask for help maybe. But now she should play with her smartphone now. No, 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 no. Okay, well, let me see. Let me check up something now, please. Okay. Let me see the time we have, okay. Okay, let us now um, create examples. Remember that we, we can also use the negative form. También podemos usar la forma negativa para dar sugerencias. Okay, I need that you uh, create some example and tell me. You don't need to write down anything. Just tell me. No necesitan escribir los ejemplos. Okay, imagine that uh, tomorrow I need to wake up at four o'clock. What can you tell me about it? Imagínese que yo tengo que levantarme a las cuatro de la mañana. ¿Cuál sería la sugerencia? Tell me. You should go to bed early. Ah, okay. I like that. Okay, another example. Show the, the alarm, alarm. But something is missing. You should. Huh? You should set the alarm. Okay. So go to sleep early. But something is missing at the beginning of the sentence. ¿Qué le falta a la oración? Shouldn't. No, 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 no. no. Maybe I, 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 I can hear it. Will you repeat again, Ana Cristina? I guess. Um, Said they were the other Mr. Temprano. But in English, but in English. So go to sleep early. Uh, you should go to your bed early. Okay. I okay. Okay. Remember that every time that we are going to express an advice, we need to put an uh, a pronoun. Tenemos que usar el pronombre. No podemos usar solo should. Okay, tenemos que ponerlo antes. Okay. You should turn on your cameras. Because remember the Insafor is going to watch this video. Solo es una sugerencia que estoy haciendo. Dando un ejemplo. Okay, what can you tell me, Marlon? Give me an example, please. He should done it in class. 
Will you repeat again, please? He should not eat in class. He should not? Mm -hmm. He should not eat in class. Ah, okay, talking about eat. Eat. He should not eat in class, okay. Sí, bueno, para dar hambre a los demás. Ah. Ver que están comiendo y nosotros. Y más. Nada. <laughs> okay, okay. Xiomara. You are saying, hey, hello, teacher. I want to give my example. Okay, do it now, Xiomara. Ella estaba levantando la mano con usted. Um, yo es la que le dije el... You, you should set the other. Ah, mira, ya me dijo, dice, okay. Okay, 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 okay. Ana del Carmen. Oh, no. <laughs> Hello, teacher. Eh, no la vemos. Uy, como no se me ve. <laughs> ahora sí, ahora sí la vemos. Se nos estaba escondiendo. No, teacher. Eh, mm, he sure eh, go to bed early. Uh -huh, okay. No sé si okay. estoy bien. Okay, okay, okay. Now you are going to focus your attention in your job. Ahora van a centrar su atención en su trabajo. ¿Qué sugerencia pueden ustedes hacerle a alguien que está ahí con ustedes en la oficina? ¿Ok? And you can, uh, you can use a name. You can say, for example, Mario, you shouldn't do that, please. No hagas eso, Mario, por favor. I don't know what Mario is doing. Ok. Veamos quién quiere hablar, quién quiere hablar. It's for me. Um, no, you, should, you shouldn't smoke at the company. You shouldn't? Smoke. Ok. Somebody else, please. She should... Uh -huh. Okay, now we are going to switch the situation. Okay, uh, I need that you pay special attention about what I'm going to tell you, and you are going to give me an advice. Ah, oh, man, I feel terrible. I got a, I got a headache. I got a problem in my head. Okay, give me an advice. You should say a bill. bill. Ah, okay, okay. Somebody else? Somebody else? You should take a medicine. No. Okay, could be, could be. Okay, what else? Uh, you shouldn't. Yeah, at work. You shouldn't? Yeah. Vital. At work. At work. Mm. Okay, what else? You should bring me the bill in the week. Mm, oh, 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 repeat again, please. Remember that I, I am the one that had the headache. And you are giving me an advice. Recuerde que quien tiene el, el dolor de cabeza soy yo. Entonces, ¿cómo you será? Should. Ah, okay. You should. You should rest a little time. Oh, okay, I need to rest a little time. Okay. Oh, I'm, less, going, oh. I'm going to sleep now. Sleep. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 
you are advising me that way, you know? Okay, what else? ¿Qué más? Piensa, 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 piensa. Teacher. Hello. No sé si está bien, pero me corrige. Okay, you, should, you should drink a coffee cup. Ah, you should drink a coffee cup. A cup of coffee is going to be better. Yeah? You should drink a cup of coffee. Sounds better. Okay, what else? Mira, tantas cosas que podemos hacer con ese dolor de cabeza. Okay, tell me. Do you sleep a moment? Okay, I'm going to sleep now. Okay, okay, okay. What else? What else? You should, should go, go to doctor. Ah, you should go to see the doctor. Okay, excellent. Okay, talking about you. Imagine that you are the boss in your office and suddenly one of your... Maybe the secretary say, okay, um, Mr. Hernandez, I don't know how to do this activity. What can you tell person? Imagine que su secretaria le llega a decir, boss, I don't know how, how can I do this activity. No sé cómo hacer esto que me pide que haga. How you are going to give advice? Uh, you should ask for help. Ah, uh, you should look for help. Okay. Look for help. Yeah, look for help. Okay, excellent. Excellent. Okay, pero ahora les toca a ustedes hacerme los ejemplos. Porque yo quiero estar seguro de que ya pueden hacerlos. You should do exercises. Ah, okay. Estoy gordito. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> ah, okay, okay, okay. I need to go to the gym and lift weights. I'm going to lift weights and do exercise or practice boxing or something like that. Okay, okay, I like that. I like that. Okay, what else? Ladies, ladies, ladies. Hey, teacher. Okay. You should read the instructions. Ah, I need to read the instructions. Okay, excellent. Ladies, you should participate in the class. Si no se me van a dormir si no participo. Karina, tell me. Um, about anything, any yes, situation. Yes, 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 um, yes. Yeah. You, you should study a lot. You should study a lot if you want to pass with tens. Okay, yo necesito estudiar mucho si quiero pasar con diez. Okay, what else? ¿Qué más? You should research, investigar, pero research. Research, algo así. Research, uh, investigate. Research, mm -hmm. learn and tweet. Okay. Okay, now uh, try to think in a situation that you need to do something different. For example, uh, for example, you can say, okay, tomorrow I need to resolve a lot of problems in my company, but I am not pretty sure what I can do first. Mañana tengo que hacer tantas cosas en la compañía y de tantas cosas que no sé por dónde comenzar. Okay, give me an advice. You should organize. Okay. 
you organize all your duties. Okay, somebody else, please give me give me another example. Me, teacher. Okay. I should have gotten up earlier. Ah, okay, 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 okay. I should not go. <laughs> really? <laughs> yes. <laughs> Why? <laughs> no. <laughs> no. Okay, somebody else, please. You must make a list of priority. Ah, you should make a priority list. Okay. Okay, I like that. What else? Can us? Okay, let us see another example that I have here. Let me see if I have it. Something else here, please. Okay, let us see. Okay. Okay, in your manual, in your book, you can find this activity. Let me get it bigger. And right here said, how do you shoot? Shoot is another way to give the advice to talk about what we think is right or wrong. And the structure is subject plus shoot or not, plus the verb plus the complement. This is the structure. Esta es la estructura, mira. Sujeto, más should, si es negativo, not, más el verbo, más el complemento. And we, we have some example here. We should upgrade our system. They should bring equipment. We should not continue with the same market. This company should drop its target. Okay. Do you understand the, the examples? Let me see. I'm yes. going to. Okay. This is the subject. This is should. This is the verb. And this one is the complement. Okay. Let me raise it. Erase. 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 Okay. Hold on. What's going on here? Okay, let, let us try to resolve exercise number five, please. Complete the same using should or should not. Try to do it now alone, and later on we are going to compare with somebody else. Trate de hacerlo individual cada uno, por favor. Try to do it now, please. Finish, teacher. Okay, hold on, hold on. Esperemos el resto ahí, por favor. I don't know if you have it, your material. What do you need that I uh, present it to you? Yes, teacher, please. Okay, I'm sorry. I do really sorry.
Okay, I guess that it is enough time. Did you finish? Hello? Yes, teacher. Okay. Uh, so now we finish to compare with somebody else. What we are going to do is that you are going to write down uh, a paragraph, a big line paragraph about something in your company, not necessarily talking about equipment, but I need that you, you should and should and should not. But let us check the number one. Let me stop sharing. Okay, right. los, los que no han participado, por favor, necesito que me digan el number one. No. Sure. Okay, but, but I need that you read the whole sentence. Necesito que me lea la oración completa, por favor. Los que no han participado, por favorcito, necesito que todos participen. Her, her product, products should be French. Ah, ah, okay, should be fresh. Okay, next. Number two, this company should not forget about quality. Should not forget about quality, okay. Number three, please, number three. We should explore new market we should explore new market okay next one please number four The machinery shouldn't be old. Mm -hmm. Shouldn't be. Shouldn't be old. Shouldn't be old. Shouldn't. Okay, all depend on the situation. Okay, and the last one, please. Number five. Number five, please. The last one, the last one, please. Last one, please. Only one, only one, no more than one, please. 
Teacher, me corrige si estoy. All the employees should not use the machinery. Should. Or should. Yeah, it's going to be, I guess it's better to say all the employees should use the machinery. Yes. Okay, now you are going to have time to write down a six line paragraph about the equipment of your company. But if you don't want to write down something about equipment in your company, you can write down about another issue. But what I need is that you, you should and should not. Is that clear? Is that clear? Yes? Yes, teacher. Okay. Yes, teacher. ¿Quién no comprendió? Por favor, pregunta. Ok, vamos a escribir un párrafo de seis líneas acerca de las sugerencias de la maquinaria de la compañía, pero te lo puede hacer uh, libre, ¿no? As soon as you finish, just let me know, please. Tan pronto termine, me lo haces saber. Por favor. Try to remember the structure that we use when we talk about should, you know? Okay, for example, I can say, it. I automatically help you. How to be a good student? If you want to be a good student, you should study a lot in order to get good grades. You shouldn't get late to your classroom. You should participate in all the activities, in all the subjects. You shouldn't use your cell phone during the teacher is explaining you a class. And so on. Ya les di un ejemplo de cómo lo pueden hacer, ¿ok? Es un párrafo de seis líneas. Ahorita lo veo pensante, pensante. As soon as you finish, just let me know, please.
Okay, I'm here. Okay, before I forgot, today um, is going to be the term of Giovanni Alexander. At the end of the session, we are going to have 10 minutes to talk about different topics. Is that right, Giovanni? Uh, 10 minutes? Yes. Uh, 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 don't have a question, teacher. Excuse me? Uh, I don't have question. You don't have question, but maybe, how can I tell? Okay, may, maybe uh, there, is, there, is, there is something that you want to talk about. Okay. I, 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 I request you to stay at the end of the session, okay? Okay. Teacher, se escucha mucha interferencia. Really? No, es que había un micrófono abierto por ahí, quizá. O cuando yo hablo, escuchan eso. Hello. No sé si alguien más lo escucha, pero sí yo lo escuchaba ahorita, ya no mucho. Sí, creo que es un micrófono de alguien, ya, ya lo vi por ahí. Justo en este momento ya no se oye. 
Recordemos que esa es parte de las reglas. Si no estamos eh, participando, debemos de mantener los micrófonos apagados, por favor. Ok, I guess time's over. Let us start with somebody. Who wants to read your paragraph? ¿Quién quiere iniciar leyendo su párrafo? Ya tenemos poco tiempo. Y ahora ya no los dejo para el siguiente día porque después dicen no, no sé, se me olvidó. Ok, don, don Narciso, I guess it is the one. Uh, me teacher. Ok. Uh, my company should expand the facilities to the better, better service customers. They should also change the equipment in the office. They should not continue using those old programming process. That's all teaching. Okay. Okay. Could, could you read again the, the first two lines? Me podría leer de nuevo las dos líneas primeras. My company should expand the facilities to the service customers. Ah, in customer service, okay. Customer service. Customer service. Okay, thank you, thank you. Okay, somebody else, please? Me teacher. Okay, let me see where you are. Okay, go ahead. There should be an Owen. There should not be all equipment. There should be package equipment in a good state. There should not be tall made of wood. And there should be measured bells versus. Okay, equipment, 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 equipment. Equipment. Okay, okay. thank you, Cristina. Hoy lo voy a llevar anotado porque para que así mañana no me digan no voy a participar. I got it here. Para que no me estén haciendo trampa. No. No, I don't know. No trampa. Me teacher. Okay, somebody else, please. Me teacher. Okay, do it. I don't know if it's about that, but okay. I I should check my email every morning and I should clean the store when I write I write at work. I should not eat in the office. I should call um, the customer. I should sell a product on their showcase and I should work over time for more money. Okay, thank you. Somebody else, please. Me, teacher. teacher. Ah, me aparecieron dos, entonces. Lady first, okay. Okay. Uh, me corriges. My my company should should be restaurant supplies. How how products should good of quality. We should in company have excellent price. The employees should use equipment the security. Security equipment. Okay. Thank you. And the word. That I need that you repeat is chew. Chew. Yeah. Sin la L, por favor. Chew. Chew. Ok, anótemela por okay. favor ahí. Anótemela ahí en el cuaderno. Y me le pone chew, no chew. Ok. Usted me dijo que le ayudara. Y le estoy ayudando, sí. Thank you, thank you. Ok, ok, ok. Somebody else, please. 
me teacher okay let me see karina yes let me write in my nice. work okay <laughs> in my work i should do all my obligation on time i shouldn't lose the pencil and the calculator i shouldn't use the cell phone in the office i should be on time and i should turn off the computer when when i finish to use it all right excellent i like that okay thank you me teacher Juan Carlos uh, Palacios. Her company should give preventive maintenance to computers. Uh, I should not wait for them to break down to do it. The company should require a guarantee of our equipment that is purchased. The dean manager should not allow then to leave the company. Okay. Equipment. 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 Okay. Sound better. Okay. Write it down in your notebook. Write it down. Write it down. Write it down. Okay. Somebody else, please. Me, teacher. Right. Okay. Um, okay. The company should build more rooms in the hotel. Um, the the hotel the hotel should have a relaxing room. The company should invest in new equipment. The company shouldn't forget to provide healthy food for employees. And the company should have enough parking for. Does it? Yeah. Okay. I got your idea. Okay, thank you very much. Okay, before to finish, because we are so close to finish, I need that somebody tell me that made me a review about the topic of today. Alguien que me haga un summary about what we started today? A brief summary. Un sumario corto de lo que estudiamos hoy, please. Only one, no more, only one. Solo una persona que me diga que me haga un resumen corto de lo que vimos hoy. Is um, how to use show and show is a is a modal verb to give advice or to talk about what we think is right or wrong. And the uh, structure is subject plus should or should not. And the bar is in the basic form and complement. Excellent, thank you. I got my notes here. Okay, for tomorrow at the beginning of the class. Para mañana los que no participaron con su párrafo lo vamos a hacer. Hoy sí ya los tengo anotaditos. Okay, let me check up the attendance now because it is time to check it. It's really late, late, late. Sí. I got it here. I got you. Okay, Ana del Carmen. Present teacher. Angel Narciso. Present teacher. 
Cristina. Present teacher. Giovanni. Present teacher. Person. Present. Jose Miguel. Present teacher. Juan Carlos. Present teacher. Karina. Present. Linda Ivet. Linda Ivet. Maria Idalia. I am here. Okay, Maria Julia. Present. Okay, Marlene. Present. Marvin. Nancy. Present teacher. Okay. Eh, Norma Carolina. Norma Carolina. Rafael Ernesto. Present teacher. Okay. Um, Raquel Judith. Present. Reinaldo. Present teacher. Suleima. Suleima a la una. Hello, Suleima. Xiomara del Carmen. Present teacher. Okay. Ana Cristina Chavarri. Present teacher. Okay. Okay, before you leave this room, antes de que se me vayan, I want to ask you something. Quiero consultarles algo. Uh, ustedes, bueno, este ya es el módulo 5. Imagino que ya tienen claro cuántas sesiones son las que pueden fallar, ¿cierto? Para que al final no les afecte en su proceso. ¿Sí? Yes, teacher. Ah, ok, ok. Ok, excellent. Excellent. I don't know if you have any questions so far from here. No question at all? No question. No question. Ok, 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 ok. Ok, well, I'm going to share with you a list of irregular verbs. Les voy a mandar al grupo un listado de verbos irregulares. Ahí tienen hasta la pronunciación en los tres tiempos. Eh, lo que puede hacer, si alguno no lo comprende, haga la traducción de la primera columna. Eso les va a ayudar mucho. Yo sé que ustedes tienen ya mucho conocimiento, pero eso les va a ayudar bastante. Ok, thank you very much. I hope to see you tomorrow. It was a pleasure to be with you. Remember the one that didn't participate today, they are going to do it at the beginning of the class tomorrow, please. Okay, have a good night. Bye bye. See, See you. Good night, teacher. Bye tomorrow. Bye bye. Okay, okay, okay. Giovanni. Hello, teacher. No sé si a mí me tocaba el one. One or one or no? Let me see. Let me see. I'm going to check up. Uh, voy a revisar ahorita la lista. Creo que le corresponde en otra fecha. Pero déjeme ver a quién le correspondía el día de hoy. Es a Juan. Ah, ok. Según lo que tengo en lista, pero permítame un segundo. And your name is Miguel, right? Yes. Ah, ok. It's going to be on Thursday 7. Le tocaría, oh. le tocaría el, día, el día jueves. Entonces le recomiendo que vaya anotando algunas dudas que tenga para que así el día jueves con gusto le ayudamos a aclararlas. ¿Verdad? El, okay, compa sí. el compañero Giovanni que se le dijo que tenía asignado los 10 minutos dijo que no tenía ninguna duda. ¿verdad? Ok. Así es que 
eh, les felicito por estar presente y por el esfuerzo y espero que podamos hablar el día jueves que le corresponde y si tiene alguna duda referente a plataformas, algún tema, con gusto le vamos a ayudar el día jueves. Good night. Ok, good night. See you tomorrow. See you. Okay, as you can see, uh, this day was assigned Giovanni, but he said that he has everything clear for the reason uh, he didn't stay at, at the end of this session. Okay, thank you very much. I do really appreciate that you watch this video and try to remember what we talk about the class of today. Thank you very much.